welcome Taurus says happy Valentine's. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful like and share as well. Taurus is Taurus, Taurus is. Ooh, I love this. All right. So Taurus is let's get in your reading. Secrets. Secrets is how I see someone using uh, the source of truth. People are recognizing what is happening. Um, and a lot of you Tauruses are going to be having some sort of a legal issues, especially lawyers or doctors are going to be having some sort of a legal issues. People are now recognizing some sort of a secret was kept and hold. And I see the truth of sorts where someone is going to be using their truth of sorts to get out some information and let people be aware of what was happening and transpiring. So Taurus is um, recognized of some sort of a, a law, some sort of a legal issue. Someone is going to be recognizing that you Taurus is have created some sort of a situation or you Taurus is, is going to be finding out that people have created some sort of a situation. Okay. So you're going to be dealing with some sort of a lawyer or um, legal issues or uh, people in uh, um, uh, you know, there is there is just people that is using the sort of truth. Is it you or is it someone? Because they're finding out some sort of a secrecy. Some sort of a secrecy is going to be coming out. The seven of emotions is here. Now, family issues is going to be here. What is transpiring for you, Taurus? So the four of pentacles in the reverse and the seven of cups. Number seven seems to be the frequency and energy that is here. Number seven, we can see the energy of number seven that is here. Um, a lot of you, number seven is here. And a lot of you, you're working on the frequency of a seven. The frequency of seven is here. People are recognizing what is in the, the stability and foundation. A lot of you add hope for some sort of a successful win. Some sort of a message is going to be coming in from the family that the conflicts is now over. So um, this is wonderful. Um, a lot of you um, hope for some sort of a win um, and uh, um, it's not going to be happening, Taurus, is because people have recognized that some sort of information, um, some sort of a secrets that you, Taurus, had kept is now going to be coming out. And there is no win-win. And um, um, some sort of information from a family is going to be coming in that the conflict is over. So I see a lot of you are dealing with emotions, emotions with cancers. Um, it's coming up for a lot of you. Tauruses, these could be family members, but emotion. You're dealing with a family in the third week. Huh? So um, some sort of imbalance, financial imbalance is going to be uh, coming up uh, of if there was um, some sort of, a, um, you know, opportunities is going to be coming up for some of you. Families um, could be healing. Some sort of a positive news is coming in from family. Um, the worries is going to be over, which is a very, very positive thing. So whatever worries that some of you had with a cancer or some sort of a conflict that was going on, it is now over. So Taurus, um, what a month. So let's recognize and see what is transpiring. So in the first week is um, Hurt Energy Week. Also the second week, that's wonderful. Taurus is... Um, in the first week, you're dealing with uh, um, hanging in lip mode. So you're bringing in balance because you're going with it to try to bring in balance to a situation. In the third week, that is the energy of transition in a corporation institution. In the first week, light is going to be shedding on someone who has used their powers in the wrong way. In the fourth week, the magician where I see um, whoever that was worried about their mother or materialistic wealth, it is going to be over and the conflicts is going to be over. So that looks good. All right. So we have balance. Some sort of a balance is going to be bringing in. I, a lot of you are going to be balancing out some situation because some sort of information came out. Some sort of a secrecy that you Taurus have kept is now out and people are really recognizing who you Tauruses are and what you Tauruses have done. So I see no success for you Tauruses in the first week because they recognize that you Tauruses has not been very honest. 
they are recognizing that you Tauruses have not uh, created some sort of a positive uh, balance for yourself. You Tauruses have created some sort of an un, um, unalic decision in some sort of a uh, um, balance that you were creating around yourself. So people are now recognizing that you Tauruses uh, have been, you know, kind of off waking some sort of a thing and trying to bring back balance. But some information that came out uh, let you Taurus know that there is no win-win in a situation because um, the information came out. They recognized that you Taurus did something that was wrong and the information is now out and they're realizing um, that you Taurus had to create some sort of an issue for a Capricorn person and they're taking down a cancer and they're recognizing the secrets between you and a cancer. So I see a balance is going to be coming in because some sort of a secret that you had with a cancer is now um, is coming out because they recognize that you had work against a, a Capricorn and they're recognizing it now. Um, then we realize um, some sort of a balance with your financial situation with your family. I see that you Tauruses are going to be, um, you know, focusing on um, bringing uh, financial stability in your world. However, this is plain. You're going to be recognizing and trying to bring some sort of a balance in um, your financial world for your family and making sure that your family is financial stable. And this is going to be wonderful. Then when we look at the second week, you Tauruses, this week is your week of um, I see you Tauruses um, are trying to balance some sort of a um, dishonest play in a corporation institution and they came down on you Tauruses because they recognize that you Tauruses had created some sort of a secrecy and had some sort of a secrecy that is coming out and that came out and you Tauruses are now trying to, you know, balance out the situation. You're standing on one for trying to balance out the situation. I see multiple um, they're going to be going back and looking at your business, Tauruses. Whatever is happening, they're going to be going through your business, splitting through your business, because they're going to be recognizing that a corporation institution had created some sort of a problem, and they recognize that a cancer um, is at a, a cancer is at a, um, it's as if the cancer is the one that created this thing, and they're going to be recognizing that you Tauruses and a, and, a, and, a, and a cancer have created a whole lot of problem, a whole lot of issue. And they're now looking at the situation and recognizing what you and this cancer have created. A bank financial institution is going to be creating some sort of a um, new stand. Um, this corporation, some sort of a imbalance of funds or money. Um, this corporation is like this corporation um, do not want to uh um progress and and create some sort of so you Taurus is it's like you're blocking someone from not getting something whatever you Tauruses are doing it is very disgusting you need to recognize that you can't just block people um from not getting something and you Tauruses could have been doing it and now they're picking up that you Tauruses have not been honest and they're going to be reevaluating the situation and recognize that you Tauruses has created a whole lot of problems and had created some sort of a false account or a false um so it, you know you could be finding it out or you could be recognizing that a corporation institution it has something to do with a bank or some sort of a government institution and some sort of a offer or some sort of a offer that you had made and they are recognizing that someone tried to uh, throw this balance out uh, and, and, and you Tauruses could be bringing this back online and saying, hey, you know, do the right thing. Do the right thing because it's not true. Do the right thing. So this is good because whatever is happening and transpiring is as if someone is really, you know, looking at some sort of a uh, information that was kept and is recognizing that people have not been honest about certain situations so it could be you Tauruses or people could be finding it out about you Tauruses okay then we are moving forward we're looking at the third week the third week a lot of you are dealing with an authoritarian figure whoever this authoritarian figure is so, um light is shed on this person they're recognizing that this person has not been honest so however this is transpiring is it a bank manager is it someone 
who is supposed to give a loan or so. They're, they're recognizing that this person is not honest. And I see someone, you Tauruses could be going and saying, hey, you know, this is dishonest what you're doing because it's as if, uh, and, and, and this, you know, you Tauruses are going to be really taking on a person and saying, yes, this is um, dishonest. You are creating a mess of a situation and it's not true. So I see now people are recognizing um, that um, and it could be you Taurus is showing up some sort of a secrets and people are now recognizing that something was really off, that people in power has used their powers in the wrong way. And you Taurus is are going to be looking at this and it's going to be bringing that balance to some sort of a un, unsheltered situation where you recognize that um, uh, uh, if you're a lawyer or if you're a doctor or if you're someone who works in the legalities, it's not being honest and you're using the sword of truth to bring back and bring out some sort of an unconventional situation that was happening and transpiring and this is just going to be so good. So I see the worries is going to be over. I see some of you Tauruses has become the leader in the third week and is showing up on um, some sort of an unconventional situation that was transpiring and is showing it up. It's in your life. It's in your private life. It's in your work life. You are standing up. You are being the authority in your life and you're bringing some sort of a worries to an end because people had created some form of worries and you are, um, you know, changing this around. Um, you Taurus is, is going to be the authoritarian figure in your family in this month, whatever is happening and transpiring, you're make, making sure that a whole law of uh, honesty is returning in the family. I see a whole lot of uh, emotional happiness is going to be coming up for you Taurus is in the third week. I see you're going to be bringing back some sort of a balance. The worries is going to be over in the third week. Oh. Emotional, positive emotional situation with the family is going to be here. This is going to be wonderful because people are going to be recognizing um, what was happening and what was transpiring. And it's going to be recognizing that people have not uh, um, been honest. A lot of you, if you are dealing with an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra or a civil service, they're going to be finding out some sort of a secrecy. Um, about a woman in civil service and they're going to be recognizing what this woman has done. Then we are also recognizing um, in the fourth week of the energy of the magician. Uh, so Taurus is the second, third and fourth week is going to be good. This month is going to be good for you Tauruses. The energy of the magician is going to be opening new doors of opportunities up for you. Um, these new doors of opportunities is going to be showing up, um, you know, multi way of creating your um, financial wealth and stability. And this is going to be good. I see that uh, um, a lot of you are going to be getting these brilliant ideas. Worries is going to be over. You're going to be ending some sort of a worries and some sort of a conflicts that was going on um, because you recognize and you realize that civil servants and people in civil servants or a Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person had a lot of secrets and people are now going to be finding out who this person is and what this person has done. Wow. So um, what we're looking at when we come on to the, um, is this if you Taurus, this is going to be showing up money um, or is going to be finding out about a whole lot of money um, that was kept or a whole lot of money that someone had and wasn't showing up of their hands. Okay. So I see you Tauruses are going to be trying to balance out some sort of a situation because some secrets came out. You Tauruses, um, are going to be trying to work with a corporation institution in order to balance out some sort of a situation. I see positive emotions is here. And a lot of you were waiting on some sort of information. Positive emotion is here. I see a lot of you are going to be um, really recognizing some sort of uh, um, unfair game that a cancer did. They're going to be recognizing that a cancer was the biggest leader and the biggest role in some sort of a secrets that was kept. I see you, Taurus, this is going to be bringing a balance to that. And you're going to be taking the position, the lead in a position to show up and protect a family from some sort of an unfair game that was created by a cancer. Okay, so this is going to be wonderful. Then I see um, there's some sort of a situation where a lot of money 
people are going to be knowing that um someone was keeping some money a aries person a you taurus is is going to be showing up a aries person or someone in power and showing up this person that this person has took money that was not theirs and i see you tauruses are no longer going to be worried because you tauruses recognize so uh, that this person tried to work against your family and you are protecting your family and make sure um, that your family is protected. And I see if you work in a corporation institution, a lot of you Tauruses are going to be using the power in order to get out and protect your family from some sort of a dishonest play. Could be your company, could be your family, from sort of some sort of a dishonest play that a businessman has done. So if you are a businessman and you have a company, um, you're protecting your family from some sort of on dishonest play that people got you in, and you're going to be finding the, the you know the power and is going to be resolving um, whatever the conflicts is and bringing it to an end. And I see you're going to be happily uh, recognizing and getting out of some sort of an emotional situation, and you're going to be happy because. You recognize what was happening, what was transpiring, and you're going to be bringing um, positive, uh, positive uh, situation for you. Business people expect um, some sort of a unexpected offer that is going to be coming in, so this is going to be good for you, business people. You business people who are worried about your financial worries at the end of the month, there is no more worries. Remember, if you're a business person, you can go check out the business channel. Um, Ketcon Business Channel, Ketcon Quantum uh, Elite Business, because you're going to be recognizing what is going to be affecting you in this month. For the rest of you, I see you, Taurus, is, is going to be the leaders. You're going to be using um, this uh, leading energy in the right way in order to show people and guide people. But at the same time, you're protecting your family and making sure that emotional stability is in your family. The worries is going to be over with whatever family issue and situation that was going on because people are not recognizing what was happening and transpiring. A lot of you are dealing with a uh, Aquarian, Gemini or Libra and the seven of emotions, twice the energy of the seven of emotions. So a lot of you, this is going to be an emotional month. If you're in a relationship with an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra, um, you're going to be very emotional because some sort of information is going to be coming out um, about a Gemini woman or a Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person that you were not aware of. So this is going to bring some sort of an emotion um, to you. And this is the seven of emotion. It is a month of love. And a lot of you who are in relationship with an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra, some sort of an emotional problem. Is going to be transpiring maybe it's your child mother that is an aquarian gemini or libran some sort of a divorce some sort of an ending of divorce and you're protecting your family the seven of emotion your angels are asking you to make an important decision that you have been putting off it is likely you know which choice you should make but you are pros um, procrastinating um so you don't upset someone else Ask Evan for guidance and then make the choices um, that celebrates who you are, truly are. And this is a situation where some of you wants to end a relationship or end a marriage. Um, and you are afraid to do this because um, you're not sure how this person is going to be taking it. And I see that the universe is going to be saying, hey, um, what is better for you? You got to choose your happiness. So whatever is happening, Taurus says, I see that the universe is going to be saying, hey, Taurus says, you don't want to make this decision because you're afraid of uh, the complication that it's going to bring or, but you need to recognize that your happiness come before anyone else. So I see um, that some of you, um, Taurus says, uh, you know, is afraid of an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person, or you could be a lawyer and is recognizing Jesus um, something has now gone sour. I never really recognized that it, that it could have, have, have this effect. And you Tauruses are going to be, oh my God, oh my God. Okay, um, I, I really need to balance this back. And I really need to bring back balance. A lot of you are dealing with the cancer and you're going to be recognizing that this cancer has created a whole lot of sour 
sour situation for you. Um, you're going to be recognizing that you need to cut loose of a cancer. Whoever this cancer is, whoever this Gemini woman is, you need to cut loose of this um, cancer. You need to cut loose of a Gemini. You need to cut loose of a Libran. You need to cut loose of an Aquarian. Um, and I see a, an Aquarian is going to be helping you to cut loose of these people because these people are bringing in emotional instability in your world you're leaving the month on a positive note where conflicts are going to be over so this is very good for you tauruses whatever is happening and transpiring you're, you're recognizing that you're leaving this month on some sort of a positive note because you're recognizing the dishonesty or some chaos that was created you're balancing out this chaos and you're and you're bringing balance to your own world. So I love this. This is really, um, really a powerful month, um, Tauruses. And you're recognizing how, um, very important it is, how, how you are, um, creating a lot of changes for yourself. But these are important changes that is going to be helping a lot of you Tauruses. To move on. I love you guys. Please remember to show your loves by thumbs up. I will speak to you. If you would like to see the extended of this reading, you remember you have to join um, in order to see it. Namaste until next time.